Hello everyone, in this video we're going to look at a new experience to change the default web browser settings on Windows 11. Although on Windows 10 users were able to change their default browser with just a few clicks, on Windows 11 the company made it harder for users to use another browser as their preferred experience, which involved having to tell the system what protocols the new browser should use, something that is not easy for most regular users to do. However, it appears that this is about to change in future updates. Starting with the Insider Preview Build 22509, the Settings app has been updated so that the default apps page now includes an option to set any web browser as the default with just one click. And to show how it works, let's look for Chrome, which I have installed in this virtual machine. And when you open the page, you can now see the setting that reads make Google Chrome Canary in this case your default web browser which includes a new set default button and when you click that it will automatically set the protocols that will make the web browser the new default but it's still not perfect because it only makes the new web browser the default for a specific protocols for example for HTM, HTML, and HTTP, and HTTPS. And as you can see, other protocols such as PDF, SVG, and others will continue to make Microsoft Edge the default. However, if you want to use Chrome, Firefox, or any other browser to open PDF, for example, you can just click the option and you can select a different browser but that's something that you have to do manually in addition when we're talking about making another browser the system default it's only for certain things like open links from an email client or other links that you see throughout the desktop experience however if you open start and you do a search and you look at the uh, web searches the links will still open on Microsoft Edge as you can see it right now. Also, if for example, you open the widget dashboard, when you click any of the links, it will still open on Microsoft Edge. Well, this is a welcome change. It should have never been taken away to force users to keep using Microsoft Edge as everyone deserves the choice to choose whatever they like to browse the web. It will be really nice if in the future users could simply click a button to set the whatever browser they want to use the default for the entire experience but I doubt that that ever is going to happen and that was a quick look at the new setting to change the default web browser on Windows 11 remember to like the video leave your comments subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet and I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing